Hello viewers, Assalamu alaikum. Today I will discuss about some basic concept of deflection in beam. So the topic is deflection in beam. So deflection in beam is nothing but the vertical movement of the members. At first you have to learn about the supports. So here I will draw three types of support. Here it is ruler support, it's pin support and one is fixed support. So in ruler support one reaction and in hinge support here two reaction and in fixed support two reaction and a moment. So these two can control vertical movement of the beam. Control vertical movement of beam but cannot control control rotation but this one can control vertical movement as well as rotation because it has a rotation if I draw a simply supported beam like that and the loading is here so it is simply supported beam so here is one reaction and here is one reaction so these two will uh, remove the vertical movement and here an elastic curve will be developed like that so here is rotation but no deflection and here is the deflection so here's the slope so it's theta angle so it's the rotation and if the one side is fixed and another side is roller and here is the load so the deflection curve will be like that so here is no rotation but for this load here deflection will be developed if I draw a cantilever beam cantilever beam with a fixed support and one is free end so here's the load so what will be its elastic curve so here's the elastic curve here rotation is 0 that means theta is equal to 0 and here deflection will be here maximum now I will draw another beam like that here is the hinge support and here is roller support and here's the load so here is free end so for this one what will be the elastic curve so it's p here is uh, rotation but no deflection so the curve will be like that and this one is free so here is no support so here will be a deflection so it will go up what if the beam is this type so the elastic curve will be here deformation and here is support so here is no deflection so here is no deflection so this will go up and this will also go up now try for this one it's a simply supported and here this loading type is uh, moment rotation so for this one it's not obvious like others and uh, this one's elastic curve is not easy to find out with visual inspection so you have to learn these two type of curve that is one is if this here the moments was like that and uh, the curve is concave concave up then it's positive for positive moment this will create it and for negative moment it's concave down so how will get it so for this one you have to draw a moment diagram so for this one its length is L and this one is L by 2 and this one is L by 2 so the reaction will be M by L and it 
also m by l so the moment diagram will be like that here's one diversion so it will be m by 2 it will be m by 2 hope you can find out it is just a simple sfd bmd so here is negative moment diagram and here is positive so for this uh, negative one elastic curve will be like that and for positive one this is concave up so for this one this will be like that so what will be the final uh, final elastic curve you can draw here like this one now we will go for an example the example is like that this is 4 kN and this is 8 kN and this dimension is 3 meter and this one also 3 meter and here is also 3 meter hope you can find out the reaction and here is the reaction will be 2 kN and it is 10 kN so the diagram will be SFD and BMD so here is 2, 2 will go up and here is 8, 8 will take down and here is 6, it's 2 and here 6 and 4 so it's 4 so it's positive and it is negative so what will be the bending moment diagram so bending moment diagram will be here is 6 positive and here is 6 into 3 multiplies with 3 so it's 18 so it will be 12 and this one is 3 so 4 multiplies with 3 so it's 12 also so it's negative and here's the positive so for positive moment it will be concave up and for negative moment it will be concave down so here's the positive and here and point of inflection so here the uh, elastic curve will be so it's down so it will be like that so here create slopes for this uh, uh, ruler support here no deflection and here also for pin support no deflection but uh, here it's a free end and 4 kN is working so here's the deflection y here also some deflection and here also deflection so it's an assumption and the elastic curve you can draw easily with this method so that's all for today thank you